TAT is uh, an acronym for Technologies for African Agricultural Transformation, a program, actually a flagship program that was rolled out with support from Africa Development Bank to drive the Feed Africa strategy of the bank. In my view, I think uh, the policy compact is uh, very important and very cross-cutting because there are many policy constraints affecting uh, uh, commodities. In fact, all the commodities have policy-related bottlenecks that need to be addressed. And I say this from a point of uh, facts because they have expressed this, they have sent me a list of uh, all sorts of policy-related issues. And these have to go away before we can realize the dream of uh, agricultural transformation. And therefore, the Policy Compact seeks to directly address these policy bottlenecks that are hampering the productivity of agricultural value chains. Actually, it is implementation that is at the centerpiece of our attention. It is not policy formulation, as you know, that is not the business of uh, a program like this one. It is implementation, and we are not also going into imp to take over implementation. We are just trying to create an enabling environment, whether it's information, whether it's capacity, to help governments implement policies that align with agricultural transformation. The future of African agriculture is bright. I think programs such as Feed Africa Strategy uh, implemented through flagship programs like TAT and many others should be able to transform African agriculture. As you know, Africa lags behind for the last 50 years when other countries or other regions have leaped forward. It is our dream to catch up and uh, programs fueled uh, by Feed Africa strategies such as TAT uh, give us the hope and the impetus to dream, to uh, leap forward and catch up with the rest of the world.